Congo is the last European town on the border with Asia and is the first European one if you come back from Siberia. Congo is a transit city located in the intersection of several major Russian highways. It's no coincidence that architectural form hub of the earth has been installed in the city center at the junction of seven roads. It's easy to get here either by car or by railway. There's an international airport in 100 kilometers. More than 300 years stays Ural Suzdal, pleasing with splendid architecture of white stone steeples and re-emerging temples. Tourists note high entertainment of Congo. Inseparable from the earth and the sky, when there are not only the river's waters, but also floating clouds. In the outskirts of the city, on the right bank of the River Silver, there is a unique monument of nature, Kungu Ice Cake, one of the largest in Russia. Fabulous beauty and majesty of the underworld are dazzling. Ice Cave is a centuries-old mystery of the Urals, hidden in the bowels of the earth from the curious gaze of the night stars and annoying sun rays, stone kingdom covered with many legends. This is the main natural and tourist attraction of the city. In addition, Kungu Ice Cave is one of the few in the world which is specially equipped for tourists. 70 kilometers away from Kungur, close to the Hollow Spring, at the altitude of 450 meters, Milagorsky Orthodox Monastery stands majestically, named Ural Athos. Tourists take away not only an unforgettable experience and legends with them, but the water from the Hollow Spring. Kungur is the only town in Ural where the festival of aeronauts is held. Every year, in late June, early July, aeronauts come to Kungur. Some come to compete for a medal of champion of hot air sports, others to experience the excitement of air battles, and others just to fly and enjoy the beauty of the Ural nature. Several dozens of air giants take off to the sky of Congo every day, in the morning and evening. The festival is divided in two parts, the sport one and the part of air battles. During the first part, aeronauts compete for the individual championship. Air battles are the unique team competitions where armies battle in a game form, conquering the air and terrestrial space in Congo. Other types of troops are involved in this game – ultralight aircraft, ground army and river fleet. The Festival Sky Fair is not only a sport event, but also the whole spectacular show which attracts many tourists from all over Russia. Whole week there goes an interesting cultural program for the local citizens and the guests of the town – competitions, discos, exhibitions and concerts. At the last day of the festival, there is a show of hot air balloons called the Elephant's Dance. Gleaming in the twilight, balloons start dancing, going up and down, hypnotizing everyone with their rhythm. In 2009, an open-air museum was opened, a square of aeronauts, with a bronze sculpture of Nikitka the Flyer, the first conqueror of the sky in Russia. At the foot of the pedestal of sculpture, the copper medallions of winners are annually put in. Square of Aeronauts is a popular place among tourists. There is a working pilot school which trains teenagers to become young sky conquerors. Delight of being, wholeness of the world, the unity of man with all life, almost forgotten people experience, a pot hot air balloons from other types of aircraft. On the edge of two histories, civilizations and great countries, there where Europe and Asia are neighbors in the sky, there where armies have been facing each other for many years, Sky Fair starts on the 29th of June 2013 in the town of Congo. Here you will find rock to relief, elevation from 0 to 200 meters, four rivers, enough fields for landing in any direction. Flight altitude is up to 300 meters. Roads for collecting are available in all areas. Competitions and guests are accommodated at the Hotel Stalagmite, where there is a room for briefings, conference room, a separate room for the press center with the necessary equipment, and Wi-Fi internet access. 
a separate room for debriefers, athletic director, guarded parking lot for vehicles. For those wishing to take part, there are sport events, there are gym and fitness center, mini bowling, tennis, soccer field, swimming pool, sauna, Russian bathhouse. More than that, you can get acquainted with the ancient Ural town on your own, taking a walk on the street, see historical and architectural monuments, admire the beauty of the Orthodox churches, urban landscapes, winding river bends. You will have the opportunity to visit the chain stores, Congress suites, pottery shop, visit the tea cellars, go rafting on catamarans, go up to the bell tower of the Tikhvinskaya church, see Kungur from the bird's view. Kungur is a hospitable town. More than 10 years we have been developing hot air balloon sport. It's time to open a window to Europe, to get on an international level. We invite you to come to Kungur land and become a member of Skyfair. Welcome to Kungur!